good morning all i hope you're all well and i hope you're all good please can we just excuse what i look like i've got really bad bags today and i just my face is very puffy but that clearly need, means that i need more sleep but today is the first step of my hair um so yeah i'm getting my hair dyed today this is all my natural hair um, the condition of it's not actually that bad. I've been really olaplexing it um, while I've had no extensions in. Um, but I've not got any makeup on because they're going to be washing my hair. Always going to look different with makeup on and makeup off. Keep you updated. I'm not going to tell you what we're doing. We're going to keep it a big surprise and do a big reveal on Friday. So today is Tuesday and I'm going to Vanity Doll and having my colour done. And then on what day? Friday I'm getting my hair extensions fitted in the afternoon. So today I'm having my hair dyed and my colour match done for my extensions and then I'm going to go back on Friday. Um, but yeah, so today is the start of the process. You can see the colour of my hair. I will get a better like before video. I haven't dyed my hair for ages so I am a little bit nervous but I'm excited. It's my first time going to a hairdresser's because as you know, my mum used to dye my hair but that's a whole different story for a different day. So yeah, I'm going to Ruth at Vanity Doll which I'm really excited about. She's like the best colour technician I've seen for a very long time so yeah i'm glad that she's gonna be getting her hands on my hair but yeah i'll keep you updated throughout the day and i can't wait to show you on friday i can't wait to see you. i'm so nervous i literally feel sick this morning because i'm nervous of what it's gonna look like but i look like a crackhead to go into the hairdressers but this is just a little before of my hair you can see the roots are very outgrown it just looks like it needs some work and um, just to let you know the salon was quite loud and there's quite a bit going on so i only managed to get a few little snippets and a little bit of footage in the salon but it does give you a little sneak peek to see what we were doing with the foils okay so i've just been to the hairdresser i'm showing you the sensations for something to look at while i quickly talk because i'm not going to reveal what my hair looks like now because it's not going to be complete until my hair extensions are done um so i'm gonna keep my hair private for now and i will show you the reveal on so friday I'm just on the way to get my extensions done it's friday then it's saturday sunday oh <laughs> um but yeah i'm just on the way to get my extensions the reason you're looking at the, the drive is because obviously I don't want to show you my hair colour even though you're going to see it in a couple of minutes because I'm going to set you up while we fit my extensions just to add some footage of actually getting my hair done but yeah I'm just on my way to get my hair extensions done and honestly cannot wait I am so excited I'm so scared of what it's going to look like all together but I'll see you soon when we're fitting them and soon you're going to see the final result little sneak peek of the colours this is just the extensions that before putting them in I do explain the colour and stuff later on in the video so the method of hair extensions that I have is braidless weave and this is done by literally just adding little micro wing rings around your hair, only a few and then sewing the actual weft to your hair. So you can see that's what Chanel's doing here, which is adding the first row and um, we've added the rings and then she's just going to go in and sew it to, not to my head, to the rings, um, just so you don't get too scared. Um, and then I also had this done for another row and then I went in and had some tapes. This just shows you how discreet the tapes actually are. And then, of course, the Cole Queen went in and styled my hair, which, can I just say, this woman needs to come live with me and needs to come curl my hair every day. Because no matter what I do, I can use the same products and it never looks how she does it. She's amazing. But yeah, just having my hair styled here, um, just so we can see the final result and you will be seeing that soon. That brush out of the curl and bringing it round just transforms the whole look. And look, this is my hair. I am blonde. I have long hair. Ah! And just like that, I'm basically a blondie. I'm not too sure how I feel about it yet. Like, I love the extensions and the colour is what I asked for. Like, it's what I wanted. But it's going to take me some getting used to this. Like, I haven't been this light since, I think I worked it out, I was in year 8 at school, so I don't know how old you are in year 8, but I'm basically a blondie, um, yeah, this is my hair, so I, let me sit down, I had Ruth at Vanity Doll do my colour, she is literally a wizard, I can't believe I've gone so light in literally one sitting, um, which... If you know me, you know if I want to change my hair colour, I have to do it there and then. Um, but yeah, I've gone this light in one sitting. Oh, I can't get used to it. I have still got like a bit of dark on the root, but it's just a bit lighter at the front. Um, and then I had, 
I went back to Vanity Doll because I will always go to Vanity Doll for my extensions for Chanel. Um, so Chanel Hair is who does my hair extensions and she's based at Vanity Doll. Um, and I've gone for two shades. I actually took a note of the two shades. Um, two shades of Beauty Works. So I've got Sunset Boulevard as my main hair colour. And then around the front I've got Scandinavian Blonde. So it's just a bit lighter around the front. Um, but yeah, I've got... Um, two rows of weave. I usually have three rows of weave, um, but I've only got two rows of weave. One of them's double up. And then I also have some tapes around the front, which are pretty much invisible in my hair. But I've just got, I think I've got one at the top, one there, and then one down here. And then a few tapes just at the back to blend it in. So in all, it is 200 grams of hair. It's two, those two shades mix, and you literally can't even see where my hair is in comparison to the extensions. I literally love Chanel. I've been going to her for years now. Um, so yeah, cannot recommend them to be enough. The team have completely transformed my hair, and I can't believe that my hair is this light and this ashy. But yeah, like I said, it's gonna take some getting used to. The vlog's a bit all over the place, I noticed. Um, so I do apologize for that, but let me know what you're thinking of the new hair, the new color, let me know. Oh, I feel like I don't know what I'm gonna wear and I feel like my makeup's gonna have to change and all that. Do you know you just feel like it looks completely different? Um, but yeah, this is my new hair. So thanks for coming along on the journey. I hope you enjoyed it. I am sorry it's a bit of a messy vlog, um, but welcome Beth as blonde and I guess summer has now begun look at this color okay it's growing on me it's growing on me already but yeah thank you so much for the team at Vanity Doll and Chanel for doing my hair I'm so glad to have long hair extensions back I've missed them so much they're 22 inch by the way um but they have been cold so that does shoot and shorten them a lot when they're straight they're about here but yeah Thank you for watching this vlog. I hope you like it. Let me know what you think of the new hair colour. And I will see you on my next video. Um, if you did like the video, please drop me a little thumbs up. And hit the subscribe button. Just a quick one. I'm uploading on Wednesday, not Thursday. So I will see you on Wednesday in Wednesday's video. Bye.